in the hole. That's what is going on everybody how are you as some of you may know by going through our channel or if you've been watching us for a long time because we've been doing this like three years now you'll know I'm a cast member now I am one of the few and final cast members still working at Disney I get asked a lot of questions about a lot of things about a lot of different things and I decided I'd just make a video and maybe it'll help dispel some rumors some myths some Unanswered question. <laughs> First question anybody asks me is, what is it like? What's it like being there? Now, I, I don't, I, we'll, we'll talk about that in a second, but people also ask me about the construction and what's going on with the construction. They think Disney is chugging along with construction and when the park opens, like everything's going to be completed. Now that is absolutely f false. Disney's not doing anything. It's for the health and safety of everybody around. All the construction at the park is 99% stopped. There's nothing going on. There are some projects on the road that they're working on. I'm not sure what it is, but nothing in the parks is actually getting worked on. <laughs> and we're back. <laughs> I'm always asked, and I never tell anybody because I can't really talk about it, what I actually do there. Now, I will tell you what I do, but I can't really tell you exactly what I do. I do wildlife and pest management at the park. So, we were deemed essential by Disney, and actually the state, if I read the news correctly. I don't really follow the news, regardless. So, we are still working around the clock to make sure that it stays magical. <laughs> I'm not gonna keep that. Yeah, you are. <laughs> My department's still working, full force, no, like nothing's ever changed. I feel very fortunate for that, that we're essential. We don't have to, as of right now, we don't have to worry about furloughs. We don't have to worry about getting laid off. I'm sure that may all change in the future, depending on how long they're going to stay closed. We're just kind of all anxiously waiting to see what's going to happen. But right now, we're still doing our jobs, still keeping the parks safe and sound. I typically work overnights and early mornings, so I'm used to seeing the park kind of it's not really empty overnight there's a lot going on there's cleaning there's construction there's maintenance but I'm used to seeing it kind of really subtle really mellow it still surprises me that I go to the park and there's just absolutely nothing going on there's nothing going on there's the there's no sounds there's you can hear a pin drop it's it's a little surreal and it's a little I don't want to say heartbreaking or sad. I don't know what the proper word would be, but like I used to walk through the park during the day and you know, you'd see all the little kids running around having fun, and the family's having fun, balloons, this, that, snacks. And now it's just kind of, it's kind of like somebody turned a switch off. It just kind of, boop, it's over. It's surreal. I guess that's the word, it's surreal. Like, any big city, you see pictures here and there, and it's just empty. Everybody's empty. The air pollution's going down. You can see more. Like, it's just kind of strange. Everything's just kind of strange. It's a weird kind of time we're in right now. There are still quite a few things going on. For instance, our job is still going on. The animal takers are still taking care of the animals. The, at Fort Wilderness, the horses. At uh, Animal Kingdom, all the animals, obviously, those don't get those need constant care so those are still getting cared for secure security is still doing their job they're walking around driving around the parks protecting the parks same with the sheriffs so they're still doing their job we're still doing ours the animal takers are doing theirs and you know everyone's just doing their part to keep the park safe and to make sure they're ready to open when they are able to open and that's another thing people people always assume I have more information than everybody else. Disney is a publicly traded company, so everything's confidential. Everything's released to the public and the employees pretty much at the same time, unless you're way up on the corporate ladder and you make the decisions. I'm not that high, I'm way bottom of the barrel. Really, anything I know that you don't know. I don't know when the parks are gonna open, I don't know what they're gonna do, I don't know anything. As soon as you guys know, I'll know. And honestly, most of the time, people find out before we do because like news throughout the night and stuff, I'm usually sleeping. So by the time I get up, go to work, work for a few hours, then I find out. So I don't know more than anybody else. So that's really it. I mean, there's not a whole lot going on 
in the parks. Like it's just us, security, some maintenance, uh, make sure the rides are running, you know. It's just real basic stuff and everyone's kind of in a holding pattern waiting to see what the virus is going to do. So we're just trying to keep the parks up to show level and ready to open when the time comes. Um, it's been a very surreal, unique experience to be able to work at Disney during the shutdown, which has never happened before. You know, they've shut down, partially shut down. I don't think they've ever fully closed. They've partially shut down a few times in the past, but this is like the first full, everybody, hotels, everything's gone. It's closed. It's, it's a pretty surreal experience. But anyway, I hope that answers some of your questions. Maybe, maybe not. If you have more questions, and if I can answer them, I'll answer them. Leave them in the comments down below. Share this with your Disney friends who have all these questions. Always remember to enjoy the journey, like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye. And hopefully this doesn't get me fired. <laughs>